my friends, a little bit of a mess here in the RC room, especially at the RC workstation, because I'm putting together the TF2, the Trail Finder 2 from RC Full of Drive. Now, this past weekend, I had a good deal of time to actually work on the vehicle. Thank God I had the time, because... Uh, the past uh, two weeks here with Hurricane Florence there kind of put a damper on a lot of things. But the build is coming together pretty quick. Uh, all thanks to my dad. He actually lended a hand in doing this build project with me. And I, he really enjoyed it. He even told me, he's like, son, I really like doing this. Uh, it's a lot of fun and stuff. And uh, he's like, I really like doing it. <laughs> so I was like, yeah, that's fine, dad. That's fine. You can help out. So here's what it looks like. Got the chassis, uh, the axles, the shocks on there. Got the motor, uh, the transfer case in there. Um, yeah. And uh, swapped out all of the factory screws and put the stainless steel screws in there. As you can see there. Over here is all the little packs of the stainless steel uh, kit there. And so I've just been putting all that in there so that way I can get rid of some of that rust issue and corrosion and stuff like that. But it's coming together pretty sweet. Uh, not too much left on it. Got to uh, ins start installing the electronics. And uh, then it's to the painting of the body shell and getting that thing squared off. But it just looks so sweet. Check out the two-speed transmission. This is the first time I've ever... Uh, had an RC vehicle that had a two-speed transmission in it, and this thing is pretty beefy and big. I think they call it the hammer case. I'm not exactly sure. I think it's they call it the hammer case. <laughs> uh, there's the transfer case, the axles down there. Uh, well, my dry shafts, and then the axles. <laughs> Uh, really nice. Uh, my buddy Paul has been really giving me a lot of tips on this truck. Um, he had me get the uh, Bauhaus uh, parts here, uh, which uh, does a lot of things. One of the things he really you know, wanted me to do was the skid plate. Now this is from Bauhaus or uh, yeah, Bauhaus. Bauhaus RC and uh, the low clearance uh, skid plate definitely gives me a lot more clearance. He's like with a factory one, it just stuck out. It's like a shovel. It digged up everything from rocks to roots and stuff like that. And he's like, with that, you'll have the clearance. And look at that, my friends. Good amount of clearance there versus the stock one, which is somewhere in here. Uh, but a good little mess right now. But, uh, but I wanted to give you guys an update on the Trail Finder 2 build project here. Now, it's it's coming to good. It's coming to well. I really enjoy it, and I, I just can't wait to get this vehicle all done and get it out there on the trails and just have fun with this truck. It's just an amazing piece of uh, RC. <laughs> Trying to think of the worst, but so far it's all coming out you know, coming out great. And like I said, I just cannot wait to get this vehicle out there and <laughs> have fun with it. All right, my friends, so if you have any questions or concerns or whatever, maybe uh, something you can recommend to me, maybe a tip or something, uh, just comment down below. Let me know, my friends. All right, well, that's it. Thanks for watching, and I will see y'all in the next upcoming video of the TF2. Thanks for watching.